Westfield W League football. Round three. This is arguably the pick of the weekend's fixtures. Brisbane Raw against Western Sydney Wanderers. A fixture that has been rather one-sided down the years. 12 meetings have produced 10 Brisbane Raw wins. A bit heavy off Claire Polkinghorne. Back with Carson Pickett, who doesn't mind a goal against the Wanderers and forces a fine save out of Abby Smith. That was curling in towards the top corner. And Abby Smith says to her defenders, focus. Chances at both ends. This is Carson Pickett. And Tamika Yallop is onside and forces another fine save out of Abby Smith, who's plunging away to her right to pour it behind for a corner. That was a wonderful ball. Evan finding Harakuni Cross. Side of the boot was intended for Kristen Hamilton. Now it's Lynn Williams who has lightning pace and she's away from her defender. Chance for Kirsten Hamilton. It's in this time. She's not missed. She's had two opportunities flagged offside with both, but she scored this time in what is her 100th senior appearance. Lynn Williams again. They look for the early release and the pace of Kristen Hamilton again. Mackenzie Arnold has to come out to take evasive action from heavy wondrous pressure. Forcing errors from Brisbane. Harrison. It's Lynn Williams from long range. Or Mackenzie Arnold, a smart save. But Hamilton on the follow-up. Oh, she should have made it too. And Brisbane have a very fortunate escape. Thanks in part down to their goalkeeper. Well back inside the penalty area. She gets great distance. Helped on by Lynn Williams. And Hamilton, it's two. And it's a double for the American. And the Wanderers have perhaps inflicted a killer blow as we move into stoppage time at the end of the first half. And that's how they, um, they get the turnover. It's worked a treat tonight. Halloway, or oh, mistake by Halloway. Carson Pickett is in. Is this the moment? It's 2-1. They have one back, Brisbane, through Riley Baisden. Americans today, isn't it? Geez, they're fierce competitors, aren't they? I think I'd be shaking a little bit if Abby Smith was coming at me like that, but... Um... Reset through Halloway. This is Cooney Cross. Oh, that's nice. Lovely touch, and what a spin by Kristen Hamilton. Kristen Hamilton, what a hat-trick! That is a bullet finish by the American. Super stuff. Three for her, three for the Wanderers, and the two-goal cushion is restored. Wow, well, that, that is definitely one for the archives there. They're quick in transition, but even... Um, Every player on their field has played their part well. Here they go again, O'Sullivan feeding Lynn Williams. Is this the moment for her? Goalkeeper Mackenzie Arnold makes herself big and strong and denies Lynn Williams her first goal in the W League. Would hurt. She, she's been strong in the air. Cooney Cross finding Williams again. Lynn Williams wants a goal, but isn't going to get one, at least not yet. Just begging to be put out in front of Lynn Williams. Clearly, Cross couldn't do so. He's then blaming your American teammates, and you've got to angle your run. Basin's cross, meantime, could be a chance here. Oh, golden chance. And it's one that should have been converted by India Page Riley. That could cause the Wanderers some problems. Page Riley finds the angle. India Page Riley. Well saved by Abby Smith. Riley Basin on the follow up, and again, Wanderers get bodies in the way. I think it was Starb who made the block. And it goes in the end off Nevin by Pickett. Baisden is away down the left. It would still be interesting if Brisbane can jag one here. And Gorry goes from long range, and it's spilled by Abby Smith. Alira Toby sliding in, couldn't get the contact required. She might have had a few more. There we go, all over at Richlands, and it is three from three for the Western Sydney Wanderers, their best ever start to a W League campaign. They are top of the competition for the first time in their history. Three goals for Kristen Hamilton, the first hat-trick ever by a Western Sydney Wanderer in this competition.